leave them alone. I came to notice this, but I said this when I was doing my first video, when uh, my colleague or best friend uh, DJ Ross, the DJ, first on. But um, I know people will come out to find uh, petty, petty issues on how they can start talking bad about this, finding ways to bring someone down, pointing at Ayamaru and other things. I've seen this, but let me tell you guys. For those who are doing videos about this family, please keep off and let our friend rest in peace. Let our friend Ross the DJ rest in peace. I've seen this video. I don't want to mention anyone's name because I came to realize that when we are mentioning their name, they are, their YouTubes are getting like, now people are giving them attention and that's what makes them so hard. I don't want to go into that. I just want to say that, please, today it has, it, it, it's in another family. Tomorrow, it will be in your own family. And the pain that you'll feel when you have such kind of problem or such kind of cases in your family. I know when it has, it, it's in another place, people will enjoy, people will laugh, people will do everything that they can do. And I was so worried about because I was I saw this guy trying to find a story like interviewing people about this case. But what do you want to know? Yes, a brother Pablo did a video the other day explaining clearly what happened to the sister. And he told us, no, my sister was sick. And that's all. Whatever killed the D Rosa DJ has been revealed. And there's nothing that's been done. There's nothing like post mortem. Nothing like no. It's death, and it's a real death, and that's all. Each and every person in this world, we will all die. But it's not good when some people, family, having a problem, you are coming in with cook stories, with a lot of things, trying to bring someone down. Finding always in the name of content. Let me tell you, today you will earn at someone's funeral, because it's not yours. But tomorrow, it will turn about you. So it's the time, this is the time that we need to condole with the family, we need to comfort them and also to give them strength. I'm going to say this. Ross the DJ, rest in peace and let's keep off that family at this time. Let me ask you, how many people have been dying in that village? How many people have been dying in that village since the world was created? Or it's only Ross the DJ who has died for the first time? Several people have been dying. But why? Because that Ross was connected to someone like a YouTuber. Now people must bring in stories talking about that case. It's not a good thing. And even you, you know that it's not a good thing. And just know that when you are doing it, I know you are feeling guilty, but don't do it because of views. Those views will never help you. That's the reality. Someone dies, then it makes a content for you. It's not a content for someone. Just to uh, point fingers, the way Pablo was saying, it's not a good thing. I'm also going to tell you this, my brother, my friend, or whatever, who are, you are doing these videos towards that family, let the lady rest in peace. It was a real death, and death is there for us, you and me. I saw this guy called Carl Vod. <laughs> Just a mention from Foskai, a mention from Foskai that this guy is no more, Carl Vod 001. I'm wondering, what's happening, man? And when I check on the videos, because I'm not his fan, I just came to check in today. I'm realizing that this guy has written my you know, has been in Yabuanse village. And he's just a YouTuber like me and you. And he's just that person. It's normal today. So, please, 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 in this world of today. Okay, so let me ask you. So, who has killed Calvo? <laughs> Guys, death is real. And when you see death hit someone's home, please. Do not celebrate. Do not do something that makes you so feel so nice because they are now in problem. You better join hands with them. Help them in prayer. Find any support that you can give out, but don't laugh about it. Don't be happy. Don't be so excited that you know you have a content. You know they're going to think. But anyway, guys, I'm going to stop there. I don't want to make any further comment. Allow me to take the moment to introduce you to this amazing journey that we are going through today. Tour from here to home. The journey begins. I'm going to show you the old trip because I took this video, but now I want you to watch this video and also enjoy the amazing trip in Africa. Kenya, our things are much love from Moses to M, East Africa, Kenya, RIP Rose. We will cry, we will say everything that we can. We must condole with the family. 
till the day they'll bury you. But for the siblings, for the children, for the everyone, may God comfort you and may God give strength. Grow Pablo, I saw you are very down, but please be strong. Be strong. God has a plan for everyone and death is real. Be strong. At this hard moment, we are praying for the family and we are here to comfort you. And I hope all of the best. Thank you guys. Let's enjoy this trip together. Amazing. Yes, good morning everyone. How are you doing? I son have a super, super nice morning coming live from East Africa. Hang over here, guys. I'm just up. It's a very beautiful, chilly morning. And we are up over here, you know. As I told you, we were not at home. But so it's another morning, a which now we are trying to get ready to leave this place, heading back to our respective places. We thank God for everything. We thank God for the gift of life. And you can see, I'm up and I thank God for the life of the day and everything. I see people are very busy strutting, packing their bags and everything. We are living over here, guys. And now we are going home. I decided to start this live, this video early in the morning from this place because it might be a longer video that we're going to do today. Uh, you know, when we reach home, we must update you on what's happening in our home, how since we left there. Like me, I left two days ago. And my wife left, um, my wife left one week ago. So, we thank God because still we can breathe. And I see members, crew members are waiting for the vehicle. If I saw you the other side, you'll see people are trying to pack up their things just to start the journey. But I'm happy to introduce you again this early morning to let you know that we are doing super well. Uh, there's something that I've been seeing going on on internet about um, the manager's death. But I don't want to talk about it right now. I'll talk it in this video, but I'm kind of in the next few minutes from now, guys. So uh, this is a beautiful world, beautiful East Africa, Kenya. You can see the beautiful of the environment, how it looks like. Everything is so wonderful, and we thank God for the great life. We thank God for everything that's happening over here. Guys, if you're watching me maybe for the first time, welcome back. My name is Moses from Moses 2M East Africa, Kenya. And guys, if you are my returning subscribers, thank you very much for coming out always to support me and always to watch my videos and always... To subscribe guys i'm very very happy and allow me to tell you that most welcome to this channel because you are being here really matters to us you are being here is very important to us and we don't take it for granted we only say thank you in a special way and may god keep on blessing you day by day a wonderful moment happy hour me and you love you all guys you have really done amazing job to my channel and right now we are on the road to 4000 in fact we are remaining with like six subscribers so if you're watching video be among the team who are going to make us celebrate 4000 subscribers today guys because i trust you when you watch this video do not hesitate to subscribe just click the red button there subscribe to my channel keep on subscribing because i'm feeling good where guys when i think about the journey where we came from up to where we are right now it always keeps me going and it always keeps me growing. I want to show you something that Modesta bought over here. Our YouTube money has done something amazing. And I want to show you. There's a goat that she showed me she bought over here. And now we are going to carry this goat home. So I want to show you this goat uh, live from the ground before we start moving. So give me a minute. Let me show you what's happening on the dragon. Amazing and much love, guys. I want to find. I don't know where they have removed it or not. I want to go there. Just to find if it's there. And let me show you. Modesta is right there. Getting ready to move. Uh, packing up the materials. Packing up the bag. I want to show you. Everything. How she's doing it. I can see she's right here. And, and over here. People. A bit of motion. Mo Modesta. Bien. Uh, I see people are moving with their bags. And I want to show you. Right here, so there's gift, gift. Carrying the big luggage. And big. Ah, I see this goat here, guys. Uh, I want to. I want to show you. There's something here I want to show you, guys. People are packing. 
ambra hii chesmo ango mamo this the bag so come over here and introduce yourself it's early morning i think people are getting ready to start the journey going home i want you to introduce yourself over here and let us know something it's early morning guys and where is baby mare uh, just come just come because of time leave baby mare uh, we are going home ah Oh, so you always wanted to say hello on my camera. Say hello to them. Hello. How are you doing? The other day you came. I want to be on your camera mm. with a pink dress. So I decided to capture her for her. But you are good. Nice. This green LSD. Mm. Why? <laughs> my wife, you see. You see my wife over here, guys. <laughs> Introducing a new wife over here. I know people will be doing a lot of comments. Moses, you remarry. Over here anyway, introduce yourself and tell us something. Yes, thank you, uh, beautiful people. I'm good as you can see it's morning. You see the further end. There are a lot of people. We just waiting to go back home for the our time here is now no. finished. We thank God uh, that is a uh, how do we call it? I don't know the name of that machine. What do you want here? Okuama. Okay, I had to pause because that was a uh, copyright somewhere. That was a noise. That was an oak cloud machine. So we are at uh, game Yala Asumbi, we're going back home, we've done... Uh, we are done with the work here. So I don't have much to say, my goat is over there. Yeah, I told you yesterday, did we show them the goat? No, you need to show them. Right? Yeah, so and also baby the man inside. <laughs> Baby, after a long time, you know, baby. I baby, know. hello, say hello, mom. Hello, hello. hello. <laughs> baby, say hello. hello. She wants to go home to their place. Hello. She doesn't really miss home for the entire one. Look at the camera, man. I don't want to talk with you. Hello, mama. Yes. <laughs> say hello. Mom, say hello. <laughs> Today, <laughs> today, baby doesn't want to say hello. So here is the goat that I told you we got yesterday. This one over here, you can see it down there trying to eat. So we can also brag once that this is a product of YouTube, as you can see it. But it's a nice breed, guys. It's a nice breed, as you can see. A very nice breed. Let me let me let me just show you. Mommy, get again, mobile. The pain squat chin. Yeah. Bye. I was trying to take <laughs> some pictures. Get 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 some pictures. They are going to be with us. So I'm still doubting whether that one will be okay or not. Once you get home, the only thing you do, the uh, first thing you do, you call the veterinarian to come and check on this door. You give at least half injection because I know the change of environment, other things will appear to be. And it's super healthy, guys. I think you can see how it is. It's very healthy, according to me. And I love, I love the breed and I love the color. Nyakabola bine, a friend you watch more. Okay, so we are talking about the goat over here. This is the product of our YouTube. And there is the hubby with the baby. Yeah, by the way, I see a lot of comments. Go Some home. people Look do like saying the camera. that. Uh, I know I did a video mm -hmm. informing our audience what we done with the first salary from YouTube. And it was saying it's a good thing. By the way, according to me, I'm feeling good. In fact, I'm feeling like I'm very okay because. So if I were to keep this money to do other things because you have a lot of things, maybe it would have gone just like that. But 
we have done whatever thing we really needed. Mom, camera, come up over here. Now, whatever thing we really get to straight, come up. Mm -hmm. Just so, uh, that's what happened. But I'm feeling so happy. I hope this will be a big achievement. Now. Let's just pray for that will be a big achievement. Let me us. just post something. So, do you know you distract me and now it's like you're forgetting what we're talking about? The comment about the first Yeah, some people are telling me that you've done a good thing. And uh, I love the support uh, that you have shown us. So the first three days, we three videos have been uh, active so well. And we have to say thanks to God and thanks to our audience. If we continue this way, you know we are road to 4,000 and just few subscribers to hit 4,000. Like six, man. If you come over, we'll really appreciate your support still. But that's how it is. I'm feeling so good. I'm very happy. And we thank God for gift of life and everything. Uh, that's how it is. Anyway, other videos we're going to show you guys living this place. Heading home, and also we'll update you on what's happening in our compound. We're going to take a photo with this goat here. I don't know who will check us or family, but we need to do that. Guys, right here now we are leaving officially at uh, this place, heading uh, to our home. People are packing their things. We want to get into the car and start our journey right here. As well watching this video guys, please stay tuned and enjoy this amazing moment and amazing video. I'm, I'm going to show you how it's going to be. Don't know you give it you don't No, no, go give it you don't you get the idea. Guys, we have entered in the car with the, the boat, man. I think I'll show you what's happening once I get inside there. Let's see. But anyway, Yes, so guys, right here we are now officially leaving this place, heading home, and as you can see, I'm taking this video right from the bus. Uh, you can feel the background uh, noise people are talking behind me. And this is a real life over here. I really love the view of this place. So wonderful and amazing. It's truly evergreen area. As I told you before, when I was coming on this side, I thought that it's just different. But I came to learn it's true, true, true. Everything is very, very similar. I love the life of this area. I came to learn that these people are also farmers and according to what I came to realize here is that they grew sugarcane. Like right here, this is a sugarcane plantation and the sugarcane plantation is the main cash crop over here. The beautiful cow, it's the same with the goat that you've just bought and we are carrying our goat in this big bus here. True life in the village. I'd love to invite you all to enjoy this amazing trip as we are going to begin right here till we get home. Amazing moment and happy, happy hour. Let me say to Marin and Modesta. That's baby Marin just wondering what's happening. But we hope for the safe journey. We want to update you on what's happening, guys. There's something amazing and very interesting over there that I will show you, but right here, 
I'm in the car, man. Anyway, stay tuned and let's enjoy the journey until we get home. We'll still update you on the best status around the world. I'm trying to show you guys the real life over here. Uh, we have been traveling for a quite short while since the journey begins. And uh, I came to notice that uh, it's like we are in another community right here. Uh, these are, these are, this tribe over here is called, these are kisses because I just noticed how they build uh, the kind of plant that they grew over here. Uh, you'll see a lot of green plantations and that's a tea farm. I came to notice that's what's happening here. And again, if you see the buildings, it's quite, quite uh, densely populated area. I love the, this home compound. It's so amazing and very organized. Yeah, you can see homes everywhere. And this tells you the tribe over here. I can see sugarcane plantations, you have tea farms, uh, buildings also tells a lot. Business going on as usual, you can see people are up. These are tea farm plantations, you see the way it's evergreen. Uh, if you haven't walked around, then you might not know about that. So I'm right here at least to update what's happening on the ground. That's this is a PC area. These guys are highly practicing farming. It's all about farming, and I love that culture because they are true hardworking people. A lot of people inside the road. They have kids and children. <laughs> yeah, they are trying to imagine what's happening. The vehicles are passing around. People are farmers. You can see cows. Uh, you can see big farms around. This is how it is in real life in Africa. In Africa style. That's a Napier grass planted because they have to give feed their cows using such kind of plant. It's another tea farm, right? So that's the most uh, source of income here. They grew tea at their own cash crop. While in my area we grew uh, sugarcane at the cash crop and also we do maize. So over here they plant maize and tea. Yeah. So it's amazing culture guys and uh, I really love that kind of culture and the style of living over here. It's a real nature in the village. East Africa, Kenya.
when I'm talking about tour, these are the things that I would love to view and to enjoy most of the time. You know, uh, very soon we are going to start our doing our tour vlogs. It's yet to come. The banana farm is full of banana, ready to eat. So there are kisses. You can see the homesteads building a mother house, a simple mother house. There's a church here, guys. They are doing their services under the tree. Enjoying the amazing moment. If you're watching this video from every part of the world, kindly take a moment and subscribe to this video because on light here is Moses 2 m from East Africa, Kenya, guys. You know, people might be asking, you are just talking but don't see your face. I am right here just to update you what happened outside here. I uh, mostly love utilizing the chance that I have because I doubt if I'll come back again to do this video. That's the tea farm, guys. Amazing village tour. Just giving you a village tour. Yes. Let's enjoy the video, guys. Uh, when you see anything interesting, I love to come out to update you on what's happening again. Stay tuned, guys. Much love from Moses 2M. I say like my power is almost going off. Let's enjoy the video, man. Yes, so guys, uh, right here we have reached home, and uh, I can see, can see people are offloading from the vehicle, and my goat is also right here. Uh, our grandmother is walking here slowly, coming home. Yeah, people are very tired, guys, over here. It was a long journey, and we thank God for making us to this place this right now. So, this is my goat. I'm coming to pick goat, take it home. My house is right there, so we have been away for quite a while, and uh, we are yet to go and confirm how our home is, how things has been, and everything, guys. So, stay tuned. And thank you very much. Still watch the video. Yeah. Hello guys. So finally we are home. Uh, you can see us. We were in church. We were praying. But uh, finally we are home. That boy is taking our God. To the home. Because he wanted to be there. Refreshed and to drink water. Which when we proceed with other ma ma activities. Yes. Yeah, so. We are here, we thank God for everything, we thank God for the gift of life, guys. And if you are watching this video, we are finally in our compound, right here, you can see. Finally, 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 in our compound. And, um, that's our bio, but then we have to go to the So, yeah, Modesta is coming, we are right home, man. This house, yay! Yeah. This boy is the one who has been here since we left. He has been guiding the home. How are you, man? I'm fine. Introduce yourself over here, boy. I am boy Jeremiah Watch Judge. Jeremiah Watch Judge. Are you are a student from which form? I'm from from from. You are in form? I'm I'm in form two. Form two. Yes. So you are studying over here. Yes, I'm. Okay. Studying over. How long have you been here? I have been here for. Two days. For two days. So yes. just been the one who is guiding our home. You know, the other day we left and a lot of messes. People were harvesting our vegetables. Anyone came here to harvest our vegetables? Nobody. Nobody? Yes. Anyway, thank you very much, guys. So here's a story, a long story, man. This guy is an orphan. The dad isn't there. And uh, he's in Form 2. Uh, he's being sponsored by someone. So up and downs are there. So we call for anyone who's willing to reach out, Jerry a good boy over here guys and we thank god for everything we'll be having a story with him maybe later or any other day but we wish him the best yeah so baby maren she's seeing a new goat in our home mom say something before we pray yes i'm now at home you can see me we thank god for this yeah hello mommy say hello 
Hello? Say hello. It's okay.